Today's video is going to be on none other than Sniper Wolf. I know that some of you requested a before and after on her, so here it is. I love doing videos that you guys want to see, so keep up the suggestions. So if you were born yesterday and don't know who Sniper Wolf is, she's one of the biggest YouTubers in the game. Actually, I didn't know about her till about a year ago, so don't feel so bad. She's best known for being a gamer, but does plenty of other videos on her channel now. Everything from vlogs to reaction videos and then some. Anyways, today we're gonna be checking out some camping hacks and we're gonna be trying some of them. Whoa, that is actually so smart. Would you poop in this? No, I'll just go in the bushes. I would rather just go in the bushes too than do this. Excuse me, sir. I'm trying to do my diddly business. Her success on the platform is huge, and Sniper Wolf is definitely rolling in all of her YouTube success at the moment. We also actually did a house tour on Sniper Wolf's new LA mansion as well, so if you watch that, you'll really see how well she's doing. Sniper Wolf's real name is Aliyah Shalesh, but she claims her real first name is Leah. She was born October 22nd, 1992 in England, but these days she lives in LA. Duh. Now she says she's from Greek and Turkish descent, but I've heard she's actually Iraqi. She speaks Arabic with an Iraqi accent and her name is apparently an Iraqi name. I don't know, can someone clarify this or is this a mystery? There seems to be some mixed reviews about the girl. I mean, on one hand, Sniper Wolf has a loyal and huge following for years now, her Wolf Pack, with over 16 million subs on YouTube and 4.3 million on IG at the time of this recording. But on the other hand, she seems to have a lot of haters and enemies too. I'm no expert, but some dislike Leah because they say she lies and does some generally shady stuff. She has been accused of faking gameplay, lying a ton about her past, including her nudes, cyberbullying others, and just being generally unpleasant, often towards other famous girls too. She also was arrested with her man Evan Sausage way back when. I think a before and after on Sausage could be fun too. What do you guys think? That mugshot leads me to another thing that Sniper Wolf apparently lies about. Doesn't she look different in that mugshot? The girl has changed a lot since the early days. A lot of online threads say that Leah often shames others for getting cosmetic work, yet she's clearly done some herself, but she doesn't admit to anything. So that's where this video comes in. We're not here to talk about Sniper Wolf's YouTube channel, her drama, or anything else except her transformation over the past few years. We're gonna see if we can figure out whether she's lying about her changes or not. What's going on guys and girls, my name is Kara, and this series we have titled Before and After. Today we're gonna look at Leah, aka Sniper Wolf, the rumored plastic surgery she's had done, and just her transformation from then till now. I've done other celebrity transformation videos, including ones on Nikita Dragon and Tana Mojo, and we'll have links to those at the end of this video. I've also been reading all your comments, and I'm gonna be responding to some at the end of this. As always, if there's anyone else you want me to document, let me know in the comments down below. Now let's get into this video. Let's start with Sniper Wolf's face. Okay, so like I said, she denies, denies, denies getting work done. Let's take this tweet, for example, when she said, I just read an article about myself, about how I got surgery to fix my chin, nose, and lips. LMAO, what I've never done anything for F's sake. Okay, but why don't we look at an old pic of her from before? Okay, first of all, let's get the obvious out of the way. Those eyebrows were not serving Leah any looks, that's for sure. I think she actually looks older here. Aside from her eyebrows, which were probably cool at that time, and don't lie, I know all of you ladies have had a bad eyebrow phase. God knows I have. We can see that Sniper Wolf's nose, lips, and just her face in general look a lot different back then than they do now. I didn't have to spend thousands and thousands of dollars to look like this. Pretty clear to me that Sniper Wolf had a nose drop. Before her nose was larger and had a bit of a bump to it, and these days there's no evidence of any bumps. It's just perfectly straight and looks smaller. She did admit to having surgery on her nose though, but not a rhinoplasty. Sniper Wolf posted a vlog explaining that she's getting a septoplasty because she has breathing problems and a deviated septum and makes it clear that it's for no other reason. So the whole point of my surgery, I am getting a septoplasty. I know it sounds like rhinoplasty, which is a nose job, which is for cosmetic purposes. I've heard this somewhere before. Oh yeah, Tana. I talk about that in our before and after bit on her. 
and other celebs in the past also have claimed to get work done for breathing problems and somehow come out of it with smaller or straighter noses. I for one think that it's a great excuse. If Leah's surgery was actually just to fix her breathing, they wouldn't have to break her nose, which is what they do in a rhinoplasty to alter the shape. So then why did she have bruises under her eyes post-surgery? And it's like, I'm gonna be making videos, cause I do daily uploads. You guys always see me, I have no time to recover. I can't like take off a week, take off a couple of months while I recover, I'm gonna be doing videos and I'm gonna look like really weird and gross and I'm probably gonna have black eyes or something and just be really swollen and ugly for, <laughs> I don't know, a while. That's supposed to only happen after a rhinoplasty. Can you blame fans for thinking she lied? Anyway, Sniper Wolf's nose looks a lot different than it used to, so I think she did get a little cosmetic tweaking done there. Now let's look at Sniper Wolf's lips. So let's remember that she says she is all natural and has never had any work done. But I don't know what's so bad about just admitting that you got some fillers. They're everywhere these days. When we look at Leah's lips before, we can see that they were a lot thinner and looked different with her face. Now they're extra full and changed her look quite a bit, I think. Even in videos, they look really plump when she talks. Personally, I think they look better now, but like I said, why bother lying about it? There's also been speculation that Sniper Wolf got some work done on her chin. I'm not sure if it would be plastic surgery or some form of face fillers, but her chin used to look a bit longer and more angular in the past. Looking at more recent photos or even in her videos, you can tell her face shape looks a bit different, almost rounder and less sharp. I know the word is that Leah photoshops the hell out of her pics too, but I'll talk about that in a sec. I'm not sure if she got any work done on her chin, but I wouldn't be surprised. I mean, her face shape does look different, especially in the chin area, so you be the judge. Something that Sniper Wolf also has cheek fillers, but I'm not so sure about that. I mean, it could be the reason her face shape is a bit different, but Leah claims it's just with age and gaining weight. Sniper Wolf doesn't show her teeth too much in pics, but she says she doesn't like to. I read some comments online saying that she maybe has veneers, but it's hard to prove since there aren't many photos of her smiling with teeth. Her teeth do look better in her videos these days compared to some older pics, but her lips could be hiding most of her smile anyways. Who knows? Okay, so I'm done analyzing Sniper Wolf's face. I really do think she looks prettier these days. I mean, we all evolve over time, that's for sure. For the record, I don't think there's a problem with getting plastic surgery at all. I think everyone's issue is that she denies it, while at the same time bashes plenty of other women for getting work done. Oh, and I found this creepy video morphing some of Sniper Wolf's old photos into her recent ones, so I'll just leave that here. Okay, let's move on to Sniper Wolf's body. Looking online, there's also different opinions about whether she's all natural here or not. I think it can be hard to tell too, because Leah is known to Photoshop her pics a lot, or so they say. First of all, there's speculation that Leah got a boob job, and I think it's mixed reviews. Back in 2014, she answered some questions fans had in this video and denied having breast implants. A lot of people ask me about breast implants. I don't have any plastic surgery. Let me just clear that up right now. Everything is 100% real. And will I ever get some? No, it's just, I don't know. It's really stupid assumptions. But she also denied getting any work done there. So given the other research, I don't know whether to believe her or not. Sometimes Leah's boobs appear to be a lot smaller, while other times they look at least a few cup sizes bigger. So what exactly is going on here? Some think that she just loves push-up bras and knows how to make her chest look bigger than it actually is, even commenting online that they've spotted her push-up bras on the floor in the background. I can see this being true, but especially in photos that were a few years older. Sniper Wolf seemed to wear similar styles that did push up her boobs. Now though I really don't know, she could have just gained weight and naturally a bigger chest, but in more recent pics, her boobs look like they could be fake. In these cases, it doesn't look like she could be wearing one of her padded bras with those outfits, and her boobs just look much higher and full. Do you guys see what I mean or am I tripping? Let's not forget Sniper Wolf has been very clear in the past how much she doesn't like fake boobs. But then you can see she also tweeted back in 2013, I gotta pay for school, bills, and a car. I don't have 10k to spare for fake boobs yet. Yet. And now we all know that she has enough money to get a bunch of fake boobs if she wanted them. So it's very possible. Aside from the mysterious boobs, we can see that Sniper Wolf has a great figure. To me though, her body looks different from photo to photo. And like I mentioned, the internet is convinced Leah photoshops her pics a lot. 
Even her face in plenty of photos looks like it's been facetuned so much, it starts to look like it's not even her. So I don't put it past her that she edits the rest. I don't Photoshop any of my pics. I don't have time for that. You think I got time to take a selfie, put it on my computer, Photoshop that, send it back to my phone, Post it on Instagram? Hell no! So as usual, Sniper Wolf denies it. But I guess there have been some times when she makes some rookie mistakes, like the background being warped or something blurred out. Once again, Leah says it's just that she learned to pose better and stuff. Or blamed it on the blankets. Anyways, there's more leading me to believe that she does Photoshop her pics than that she doesn't. But I'm not an expert. A video I watched by Nerd City did actually go more in depth with where and how exactly it looks like she edited her body, and it was pretty on point. So the, ma the major error in this photo is that it looks like someone has clone stamped an overspray onto the wood, onto this dock here. It looks like someone has accidentally erased where the backside of her knee and thigh make contact with the wood. The leg and the dock are, have basically become one Thanks. I'll let you guys be the judge again. Let's just say that Sniper Wolf is all natural and doesn't Photoshop her body either. What are the girl's secrets to keeping fit? Next question is from Jasmine Ashley. You have a nice figure. Thank you. Do you work out? If so, would you be up to making a workout routine video? I don't really work out. I mean, I have worked out like three times in the past like two months. But I don't think that really counts as a workout routine. But why I do want to work out more and I've been trying and I hopefully I can work out after this video. And once I have like a set routine, I will try to make a video. In the past, Leah has said that she doesn't work out and doesn't like working out. She has posted videos showing proof that she does actually exercise though and tries, just maybe she isn't that consistent. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Leah more recently posted on her other channel, Little Leah, a video of her workout routine, which was more legit. This is my absolute favorite thing to do. See, I have a really bad back, so I always, always, always have to stretch it. So I just get on the GHD and it holds me by my feet. She clearly has a gym in her house, so obviously she does some physical activity, but who knows how often. I don't think that Sniper Wolf follows any specific diet or nutrition plan either. Whatever she does to keep her body fit, if she isn't editing her pics like they say, then good for her. She must have a good metabolism to look that fit. Wrapping up Sniper Wolf's transformation, I don't think there's anything major that has changed in terms of her hair or makeup look. Like we already know, her eyebrows look a million times better now than the early days which obviously changed her face. Leah also wears contact lenses sometimes, which would explain why she looks different when she rocks her natural eye color versus the lenses. Makes sense. But her hair has always been pretty much the same dark brown color, which seems to suit her and is definitely a signature of her look. It's no doubt that Sniper Wolf has changed a lot since the start of her YouTube career. She's been on the platform for a while. Although age and weight changes can definitely make a difference in one's appearance, I'm not convinced that's all that's happening in Leah's case. She never admitted to getting work done and likely never will, but when you see before and after pics, it seems pretty obvious that she's gone under the knife. At least a little bit. Whether it's the nose job, some lip fillers, or even a different shape to her chin and jaw, Sniper Wolf's face looks different these days. Personally, I think that whatever she did, she looks even better now, but since we have no proof, all we can do is guess. And this whole photoshopping business with her full body pics really threw me off in finding out if she's all natural or not. What do you guys think? Are the rumors true and is Sniper Wolf not being honest with her fans about getting plastic surgery? I think if any of her wolf pack is watching this, they will totally think I'm wrong anyways. Well, either way, Sniper Wolf stays at the top of the YouTube game. And like I said earlier, if you watch our recent house tour vid on her on this channel, you'll really see how she's killing it. Okay guys, it's that time again where I read out your comments from our previous videos and see what you guys are saying. This one is from our recent Kylie Jenner house tour vid. Heavy Metal Kitten said, She wouldn't even notice if anyone else lived there with her, lol. First of all, I like your username Heavy Metal Kitten. And I know, right? Her place is insane. The second comment is a lovely one on our Lindsay video, but this time it's not about Lindsay, it's about me. Kiwos Rewis says, 
The presenter are a hundred times uglier than Lindsay. You have no right to talk about people. When you are more ugly than her, did you make the dog plastic surgery? Okay, well I don't know what make the dog plastic surgery means and now I would love to know and thank you. I'm glad to know how you truly feel about me, Kiwos. I would also never call Lindsay Lohan, or anyone else for that matter, ugly. And finally, Miranda's American Girl doll channel commented requesting a Cardi B house tour, which I know you guys want to see and I'm definitely working on it. Alright guys and girls, that wraps up this video here on Before and After. If you want to talk more about Sniper Wolf's transformation, you can hit me up on Instagram. Let me know who else you would like me to make a Before and After video on, and I'll see you guys in the next video. And if you haven't yet, hit that subscribe button. Let's get the 50K to 100K. Bye.